Hi, it's Eric with Cat Avenue, and today I wanted to show you a couple of new features we have in the ducting utility. The first one is in the HVAC diffusers module, and here we have a new duct position called side. So previously we only had the top duct position, and now we have a side position. Let's just make sure that everything is selected correctly. So we need a rectangular to round, and our placement's gonna be from the center, and I'll show you how to do that. Our duct size is four inches, diffuser width and height, 18 inches, and then eight inches for our depth. And down here is a 3D toggle to make sure that's turned on. Let's go ahead and exit for now because I wanna find where the center point of that diffuser is actually going to be. So if we zoom down and we create a new layer, let's just call this construction. We'll make sure that it's active and then we'll close and we'll just draw a line starting from the end point there coming down eight inches which is the height of that diffuser and then coming over nine inches which is half 18 inches that's going to provide us with a snap point so if we go back into our diffuser utility it's really just a matter of picking the draw button here and then snapping to the end point here. It's wanting a vertical up direction. We can just left click here. Just wanna make sure that the F8 key is turned on or the ortho mode is active so that it's straight. So we click there and then now it's wanting the duck direction. So we'll click any point out here and then exit. And now we have that diffuser drawn in there. Let's just check it real quick. So it looks like it's all correctly placed in there. Now what we can do is draw in our duct run. If we go over to the duct accessories underneath flexible duct, we want to make sure that the smooth option is turned on. So now the smooth option is again, another feature that's been recently added. Here I have flex duct at four inches and my bend radius two times the size or eight inches. Again, let's draw some construction lines in here. My construction layer is still active. So let's go ahead and just draw a line from the center snap here to make sure that center snap is turned on and then come out eight inches and then up two feet and then over let's say four feet i'm going to go ahead and check my clearance to make sure it's clear through that truss there which it has and now it's really just a matter of snapping over these endpoints so if we go back into the flex duct utility choose draw snap to the Endpoint here, 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 and over here. And press enter when you're finished. And now we can just go back into that layer, the LA command, and isolate that layer using this button here. And then just erase our construction lines and then go ahead and just turn these layers on like so. So hopefully this video has been helpful. Feel free to email or call me. Number here is 888-271-7121. Have a great day.